Hello guys and welcome back to the ZooCast! Hooray! We haven't been hot in absolutely ages and I'm so excited to be back. Look, there's Iris and a sheep, which I think I am actually going to capture um, because we've got our sheep pen. This is the last thing that I worked on when I came on the server. Wow, I can't believe it's been so long that I've been away. Oh, it's so good to be back though. Hi Iris, are you hungry girl? I'm going to feed you. You don't like it when I've got my sword out, I know. Yeah, I missed you too, I missed you too. Oh, you're such a good girl. You're such a good girl. <laughs> All right, well, let's grab us. Let's grab us this sheep. Do I have anything on me? Okay, we're gonna have to run in. Let's put my um diamond chest plate on while I'm out here. Don't trust any of the bad guys that's, that are that are around here. I once like met up with a um what do you call that? I forget what they're called. Those like really scary like wraith things. Whilst I was running around, and it was like honestly the most scary thing of my life. Oh wow, the, the, the cicada is like really loud. <laughs> Hi Iris! Okay, let's replant all of these. And let's go lure ourselves. Let's go lure a sheep, Iris. At least with that cicada there, I know like when like night is coming without having to look. I think that like warns you of that. Right, come on then sheep, you're going to become part of my little family. Hey kitty! Come on, sheepy. Come on, sheepy. I have no idea what's changed on the server because I've just been absolutely like chocker block so busy that I haven't been able to catch kind of Kaf and Siri and like been able to record with them. And I haven't had a chance to watch any of their videos because normally I'll kind of sit back and like watch all of their stuff. But I just haven't just haven't had the time it's really distressing because I absolutely love like finding out what's going on in the zoo cast and like what kind of projects and stuff have been happening right let's feed these guys up we need you and you have a baby make a baby yay baby <laughs> and once we have enough of these guys we can start dyeing them and we can have all the different colors of sheep so exciting all right i have a good design actually i think probably one of the things we're going to work on today you and me iris you and me we're going to work on making the sheep enclosure like look a bit kind of a little bit prettier i think add a few add a few plants and things to it and make it look really smashing and um, I think in a, f in a future episode, um, we're going to have to do lots of exploring, find out what's changed. I know that the others have like been to some really crazy, amazing places. Like I know Siri went to the Twilight Forest and um, Kaf said he like found something really amazing. But I have no idea what it is yet, guys. So because I've not been on for so long. Come on, Iris, you can come in. Come on, Ingo. Come on. In you come. In you come. I have to go all the way back here to get you to come inside. Come on, Iris. She's like the worst. <laughs> okay, you can sit up on the table. There you go. <laughs> I think I might have to move this guy because he is super loud. Oop. Wow, he makes a squidgy noise. What's that? I saw something jumping in the grass. It's a snake. Is he going to continue making that noise in my hand? No. Wow, you you are very loud, sir. You are very, very loud. Where can we put you? I think we'll put you amongst all the plants and things because I think you're quite like living in there. It's not too bad. Oh, here's my old honeybee. Hi, honeybee. Oh, we better go check on the honey, actually. Oh, so much to do, guys. My my things have just been left here. Like, I think the others must have been like looking after this while I was gone because it's uh, it's looking pretty good. Like, we probably just need to like harvest a few things, um, add some more plants and things where there aren't still some missing that I haven't managed to get hold of yet. But overall, it looks to be pretty good. I'm pretty pleased with how things have been going around here. Right, let's go stick these over here. Why are you jumping up and down on your butt? <laughs> you silly dog. Right, let's, let's grab these. And wow, of so many. Uh, we're going to have to make some. Actually, let's make some candles whilst we're here. We might as well. Oh, look, I put some sugar in there. All right, let's make some candle wax whilst we're here. Uh, let's grab these. Give them to me. Put them back. We'll make some honey a bit later. I've got so many, like, well, not that many candles, two white candles, but like so many that I could be making. Well, where did the sugar go? I don't think I have a place for sh Oh no, wait, I do, I do. <laughs> I've been, I haven't been so long on the server that I've like forgotten where I keep everything. Like there's all like my stuff in there. Um, I've got a few snacks. Um, I might put this wheat away actually, because we don't really need it. Because we've got plenty of snacks and things going on in there. You can live up there. Pepper, tomato, uh, seeds. 
go here. Excellent. I remembered where things I remembered where things are kept. <laughs> it's not too bad after all. I have so many swords. I completely forgot I had all these swords. I might put my proper armor on just because. And um I wonder where my backpack is actually. I must have put that away somewhere. Never mind. That's fine. I'll find it sometime later. What we're gonna do now, let me go into my iris. How did you how did you do that? You're a magical dog. I forget you're like a magical rainbow dog. <laughs> she just like was like, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna teleport right there to where you are because I don't want to leave you alone for too long because you're a human that can't be trusted to like look after yourself. That's probably what she thinks of me. I'm pretty sure. All right, I'm gonna make an iron chest because I want to have. I didn't actually need to. Oh, I haven't played like on this in so long that I forgot that that, that, that does that. <laughs> you don't actually need to grab things out of the chests to actually use them. All right, my idea is to have in the sheep pen over here um, a tree which has got a chest underneath it where I'm going to keep all the wool and maybe dyes although I don't really need them that much but definitely like shears and things and I think the tree is going to go about here and then we'll put the chest in the ground oopsie just about here there we go um, I need some bone meal could do with some bone meal could do with a quicker way to open and close that but never mind we're good. Now, I wonder where... That's the problem with, like, not visiting this place in so long. I've actually forgotten how I've organised my chests, because nothing is kind of labelled at the moment. That's another thing we need to think about, guys, like, labelling chests. Iris, you probably know where everything is, but I'm gonna... Oh, yep, there we go. Lots and lots of this, so we don't need too much, actually. Let's just take... Yeah, that'll do. That's enough. That's enough to be getting on with. Plenty of that. And what I also need to do is kind of go around and pick up a few like plants and things that would be nice kind of for the sheep. I think there's loads of these like butterfly shrubs like all over here that we could grab. I might just take a few of these now actually. I need some shears to kind of grab other things. Uh, let's have some of these blue ones actually. They're quite nice. Oh, and some ground cover as well. <laughs> it's great. I love playing in vanilla Minecraft. Like I really missed it when I was kind of on here like full time. Let's have a, um, let's have a bush actually because uh, they quite like those and maybe some of these kind of just like plain colored ones we don't want anything too like brightly colored because like where sheep live tends to be kind of like scrubland so you don't want anything too too much with we'll some of these actually those will do I'm as bad as Siri <laughs> when it comes to plants but I do I like don't mind having like all the like less plants like when you're in vanilla but when you come you're here it's just like absolute like paradise you're like wow so much stuff there we go perfect size tree not bad at all and let's part putting some of these everywhere so let's oh let's maybe put these at the bottom of the tree because then it like it's like they've fallen kind of down so we'll kind of put these around here that looks good. That looks good. Hi, little sheepy. Okay, so we'll have some shrubs. Tend to like it more where the sun is. So we'll have some of these around here. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Um, gooseberry bush can go over in the corner here. I think we got some gooseberries for that. I wonder if I can eat these. Om nom 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 nom. I certainly can. You only get half a haunch for that, but never mind. All right, these are pretty. We'll put these somewhere nice. We're going to have one here. And um, let's have one right over here, so they're not too close to each other. And oh gosh, we've been going for so long; it's almost night time already. The thing about like being on the zoo cast is you've always got so much to do. Like the passage of time almost seems to like mean nothing. Um, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Those plants are really picky about where they want to live, but once you've got them down, that's pretty cool, right? That is looking pretty nice. I'm gonna get you guys some jacko lanterns. And I think the other thing we do is scooch, scoochy. The other thing we need is um, some bushes, probably off of maybe an oak tree or like a birch tree that we can stick in the ground um, so that you can't actually see the jack-o'-lanterns that well so that they're kind of hidden. I think that'd be quite a nice thing to have. Can we sleep? Yes, we can. Woo! I'm so excited to be back here, guys. I think one of the things I'm definitely going to do, I mean, the other guys seem to have got on pretty well, like in the Twilight Forest and seeing some of the amazing stuff that you can get in there. I just like, I can't like not like go and 
go and explore it myself. So I think I'm going to maybe in the next episode or the episode after we might go and explore Iris, the Twilight Forest. I might leave you here, actually, because <laughs> you have a tendency to get lost. You know you do, girl. You know you do. Okay, that doesn't, doesn't go in there. That goes in here. Oh, wow. Scatterbrained. There we go. Right, let's get some food out of our pack. Oopsie. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Give me foods. Um, what could we eat today? Hmm, I fancy a ginger snap. Let's have a ginger snap. That looks pretty tasty. Ooh, that was a fulfilling meal, I think. I really like this door, by the way, guys. I installed this ages ago, but never, like, mentioned it. It's, like, one of the carpenter's doors. And I haven't decided what material to put around it, but I was thinking maybe, like, one of these kind of grey blocks. So it's kind of like a grey door or maybe, like, a white one. So it's, like, a pantry door, like, leading into my uh, my pantry. <laughs> now, pumpkins. Pumpkins, pumpkins, pumpkins. Lots of pumpkins. What on earth was that? Oh, that was a zebra. <laughs> For ages when I've been doing this, I have um, been using my speakers to like hear the sound. But recently I actually got um, some of those like in earbud headphones and now I can like hear everything. I'm just kind of like every like little noise like is really startling to me. I'm like, oh my goodness, <laughs> what was that? <laughs> but it was just something really silly like, you know, a zebra. Uh, okay. Yep. Okay. Yep. I'm just gonna leave that. I'm just gonna leave that like that. Um, <laughs> let's do eight of these. Oh yeah, look, eight torches right there. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave that. Oh, I'll tell you what we actually need, guys, before we go on on our adventures is some shears. Now, I don't know if I actually have any shears. I probably do, but we can leave these in the, the sheepy chest once we've kind of grabbed some stuff. Right, let's have a little mixture of this because I'm going to cut these down soon. So let's have some of these. Nom, 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 nom. Give me all your branches. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, there's some pretty flowers around here. And a pretty kitty. And a snake. Ooh, do you see that? An apple just popped out of there just for me. Whee. Excellent. Where did all these come from? I guess they must appear. Oh, no, my inventory is full. Right, let's put some stuff in the snack pack. Open. Open sesame. There we go. We'll put Iris's meat in here and maybe some of these shrubs just for now so that we don't have a completely full inventory. Are you glitching? I don't like it when they glitch up there. There we go. There we go. Okay, that should be good. We'll cut all these down in another episode because I'm always scared that they're going to like ruin my axe if I like cut all of those down. But that should be enough for what we need. Now, I'm wondering if I should place them randomly or if I should kind of have a bit more of a pattern to them. I think random might be a bit of a better choice. Hi, guy. Let me think. Well, we could kind of do them like in between these ones. I was going to reorder this actually so that we had like more lights because that's like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And then it's not. So we could have one, two, maybe and one there. And then one there. Oop, that's like clay. Hmm. Cool. Okay, let's take that back out. And put some dirt. Ooh. These actually heal up in sunlight, which is really funny, like, especially if you use them more. So one, two, three, four, five, six. There's no real like midway point for that, like, because it's kind of in between these two. So I guess we could have um, a light about here. Okay, we'll go down two. Don't fall in there, please, Mr. Sheep. It's not good for you down there. Okay. Ooh, no, I saw that. You were going to go for it. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, look at that. Can't even see it. It's like part of the ground. Okay, we're going to have one over here somewhere. Let's put it here. Be a good place. Don't fall down the hole. I think they might be... um too wide actually the sheep so they might be okay it's just the babies we've got to watch out for little funny little babies okay let's put one here and then we don't have to worry about putting one under the fence boop boop give me my give me my dirts thank you uh and then let's put one here Ooh, we're gonna have to dig that out there we go so good having all my like old tools back because I've gotten used to having like really rudimentary like tools <laughs> and it really makes a big difference when you've got these like fancy 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 things that Kath made me 
Right, that's another bit of... I love my little picky. There we go. It just adds like a little something to the area to have all of these kind of stuff in it. Maybe we should, well, we have enough to kind of mirror that effect on this side actually. So let's put a pumpkin there. And let's put a pumpkin sh in a sheep. <laughs> Maybe I should have a scarecrow in here as well. I quite like building scarecrows, like our one-armed scarecrow over there that I don't think I've ever given an arm to. Every time Siri says that, sees that, she's like, can I um <laughs> give this guy an arm? <laughs> Um, should we put any shrubs anywhere? No, nah, I don't want the sheep to like accidentally climb out of here. But I think that's pretty good. Sweet. Ooh, it's still pretty hot here at the moment um, in old Ingerland. I don't know what it's like where you guys are, but I have to like turn my fan off whenever I do any recording and it's like really getting like steadily hotter in here as we as we go. <laughs> I think probably what we'll do to finish off guys is I might do a bit of harvesting. And we could probably make some food. I've like pretty much forgotten like all the recipes. Oh my goodness, I forgot about this. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave that, Iris. I'm just gonna leave that as it is. Now, where can we put all our leaves? Yeah, let's stick them in here for now. Let's get these out of the snack pack. You don't belong in here. Well, you kind of do. Um, let's put these where they belong. You guys can go in the plants. Let's think, I've already got loads of these. Hmm. Oh, an apple. Um, apples go here. Yes, they do. Um, pumpkins. Pumpkins go here. Uh, here. There. Uh-huh. 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 And... Oh, look at it. Oh, no. <laughs> I bet you guys saw that in my inventory. And we're just absolutely like, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, dear. You know me. I don't even know what I've got in my own inventory. Like, this is bad. This is bad, guys. I'm going to have to spend some time. I literally, like, jumped on, was like, yep, going to record straight away. No messing. No preparing. And that is that is generally what happens when you do stuff like that. Um, let's make some candles, actually, while we're here. I don't know if I've ever made any candles on camera before, but I think it would be a good thing for you guys to see. Uh, wrong chest. This chest. Oh, look, there's my backpack. I wonder where that I've gone to. I'll have to get that out later. Okay, so I think it literally is just... Yeah, like that. Now, I'm going to have one of these. And what colours do we have? Mm, let's make some cyan ones. And um, let's make some light blue ones as well. They're like nice coloured candles. So we'll have some. One of those and one of those. Yep. Cyan candles. And let's have some, some pretty blue ones as well. Yay! They're so pretty. We could maybe replace some of the candles around here with like pretty candles. Let's have, I could take this one away. Um, I think cyan candle here. Oh yay, it's so pretty, look at that. <laughs> it just like adds a little something when it's like not all the same kind of thing. You know, I, you guys know what I mean. Oh yeah, I was gonna put some bookcases here as well. Let's put the blue candles here. One there and one there. That looks nice, that looks pretty nice. And then we're going to have some bookcases with all like my books and things in. This has got some of our books up here already. Uh, Siri was going to show me how to make one of those thingamabobs. What do we call them, Iris? What do we call them? A uh, Candles can go in here for now. Where are my words today? Oh, she was going to show me how to make um, a clipboard. That's what I meant to say. Yep, I want you to go up there. Thank you very much. What am I going to do with these spare ones? Uh, let's put them in the, this box back here with this stuff. Okay, you can just go there for now. Um, right, what food have we got actually, guys? Uh, let's have a look um, and see if we can figure out what we want to, what recipes we want to use. What do I know from memory? Okay, I know how to make dough. We've got dough. Ooh, peanut butter. Let's make some peanut butter sandwiches. Oh my goodness. Peanut butter jelly. What could we do? Can we make cactus fruit jelly? Hmm, I wonder. Now, how do you do this again? Is it R? Okay. Or is it U? Oh, there we go. Okay. Can we make cactus fruit juice? Nice. <gasps> fruit punch. Oh, I wanted to make cactus jelly. <laughs> um, I bet we can do it with these ones, though. Let's do, let's do strawberry um, grape. Blackberry, blueberry, and raspberry. Uh, I'm not that 
Mm, grape is kind of like a classic jelly, isn't it? Okay, we'll use that. Now, what else do we need? Let me see if I can remember this by heart without having to like look it up. Okay, we need we need some bread for a start. So let's cook how many of these? One, two, three, four, five. So we'll leave one of those in there. Stick these in the furnace. Oh, look, <laughs> I was making raisins. <laughs> uh, let's just stick a bunch of these in here because I've got loads of them. <laughs> I've got loads of them. All right, let's make some jam then. So I think it's this, it's sugar. And is it the saucepan? Is there another ingredient maybe? The pot? No. Uh, oh, I bet actually if like, we could just look it up and it would tell us. Um, strawberry. Strawberry juice. Fruit punch. Aha. Ah, the juicer. Okay, I knew there was another thing that we needed. Okay, so there's the juicer. All right, strawberry jelly. Now we're going to have grape jelly. Blackberry jelly. Excellent. Blueberry jelly. Oh yeah, a blue sandwich. It's what my life is all about. <laughs> and raspberry jelly. Mmm, delicious. I'll put those back in the thing so that we can uh, have some more raisins because I do enjoy, I do enjoy a good raisin. All right, let's have a raisin. <laughs> Can make some trail mix. I really wanted to try that. Okay, so we've got our bread. Okay, we need to use the cutting board for this one. I think it's just this in the cutting board. Let's try it. Uh, and peanut butter. Yeah. So let's put all these in. This is a strawberry peanut butter jelly sandwich. A blueberry. A raspberry. A PB and J. This is like the classic PB and J. <laughs> that's really funny. I didn't realize it was grape jelly that's classic. We don't really eat peanut butter jelly sandwiches in uh, in England. That's like not really a thing that we have. It just like really excites me because it's kind of like a foreign and exciting thing for me. So we're not hungry. <laughs> I want to be hungry. Jump up and down so I can eat a sandwich. <laughs> oh dear. All right, guys. I think that's probably going to be it for this episode. We've made ourselves a jelly sandwich. Just go and sleep, just so that no monsters like disturb my lovely like sheepies, because that's what happened last time. That's how I lost all my lovely sheep's. <sighs> and I think because we've got all these peanut butter jelly sandwiches, it would seem like you know a waste to just use them like around the farm. So I next episode might head over to Calf's house and jump into the twilight forest, so we can collect some of the really beautiful plants and trees and just kind of cool stuff that's in there. I might see if the others are around to do that with, but if not guys, I will be seeing you next time here on The Soup Call.